Hi, my name is Adrian Ho from SMA Australia. Today I'm going to show you how to connect a Web Connect module into our TL-21 and our TriPower units. I'll also show you how to register them into Sunny Portal. First, make sure the system is turned off by switching off AC and DC switches, then remove the ESS handle. After that, remove the bottom lid. Now loosen up the screw for the display, and then you can flip the display up. Fit in the Web Connect module. Don't forget to tighten it up. Now you can fit in the patch cable into the module. Flip back down the display board. Tighten up the screw and fit in the cable into the display. Make sure you put back on the bottom lid and the ESS handle. Now you can turn on the system. For the TriPower 5 to 9000 TL-20 inverters, WebConnect is already built into it. You do not need to retrofit an additional WebConnect card. All you need to do is to fit in an Ethernet cable. Make sure the system is turned off. After that, remove the ESS handle and the bottom lid. Then you can connect the Ethernet cable into the port. Make sure you put back on the bottom lid and the ESS handle and turn on the system. Now you can connect the patch cable to the router and I'll show you how to register it to Sunny Portal. With the inverters turned on and the Ethernet cable plugged into the router, now you can head to sunnyportal.com. In the website, select Plant Setup Assistant in here, click on Next, because we are registering inverters with Web Connect. If you are already registered to Sunny Portal, then you can simply put in your email address and password. If not, just simply register here, and Sunny Portal will send you an activation email. For this example, we're going to use Solar Academy email. For the plant name, just make a new plant name. For this example, we're going to use SMA Australia Web Connect. Just create a password. Then click Next. The PIC and RID numbers are required to register the Web Connect devices in Sunny Portal. You can locate these two numbers either on the Web Connect piggyback card or on the name plate label of the inverter. After putting in the PIC and RID numbers, you can click on Identify. Sunny Portal will then locate the inverter. Here we have a Sunny TriPower 17000 TL-10. You can add up to four Web Connect devices in one plant in Sunny Portal. After all that is done, you can click on Next. Sunny Portal will then ask you for the plant properties. Just simply put in some values in there and click on Next. After confirming all the information, you can click on Finish and Sunny Portal will register the plant. And congratulations, now you have registered your Web Connect inverter online to Sunny Portal. You can click on to the plant tab, and this will show you the instantaneous data of your plant. And that's how you register a Web Connect device into Sunny Portal. My name is Adrian Ho from SMA Australia, and thanks for watching. Mm -hmm.